Hey, this is Time Bomb, and if you're first time checking out the channel, hit that subscribe button to catch all the updates. Thanks a lot for joining me here today. I'm just going to go over how I am returning the ball for touchdowns off of kickoffs. I know I'm sure you guys a lot of times are kicking it to your tight end, but if they do make the mistake of giving it up to one of your return men, this is what you're going to want to try and do. So we're going to take a look here at some of these. I always get it from the running start of the end zone. And then I'm just using the stick, maybe using a juke like that to cut back, and then another one there. You basically need to be alone. You have to see that there's no one really upfield too close to you when you try a juke move because there's a high, a high, high chance that that next guy, even if you do make the juke move, will come in with a hit stick and knock the ball out of your hands. So you do have to be very careful. Here again, on this one here, this next return, I'm taking the ball from a standstill, which is round, this looks rare. This looks like Hollywood Brown. And I just kind of go right up the middle here and just avoid everyone, narrowly get by my own guy. And I'm able to just kind of just cut through. You just kind of something, you don't need to use those moves. You can just kind of cut through, weave your way, just look for those holes and just try to get to them as quickly as possible. Here, I'm going outside. And again, just trying to beat that last man. I use that juke. I have enough room. One more guy here to beat. And I just powered up the sideline just trying to hit that sprint and get into the end zone so we're going to take a look at this next one here again i get the ball with a running start cutting up the middle and just find that hole and that's all i do i just hit it and again just start to swerve all around and find my way up the middle of the field you know you just kind of got to see you just got to look for the hole basically off those kickoff another really great running start here and i see that room to the left weird little juke fumble the ball the next man picks it up and look if he's going to take it in look at that spin move gonna shake those two guys loose right there that spin move was awesome and then we get into the end zone that's kind of a lucky one right there and that's just underlying you really do have to be careful when you return the ball because those juke moves any of those moves if you don't do them at the right time and you take a big hit stick you can lose the ball just like that so be very careful here we see again i'm coming up the side just doing my little swerve he's whiffing on the stick and i'm able to find my way through and get all the way here into the end zone. oh one last man coming at me but too much speed he's not going to catch me and i get in there so this last one here you see a good amount of speed using my tyreek hill up the end zone and i kind of cut back the way it come from i got it got lucky i got really close to a guy there but then the way that i swerve in and out really shakes these guys loose and i'm able to get another touchdown off the kickoff i do i do find myself getting a lot of good kick returns i'm able to get touchdowns but you know fairly regularly obviously not every game but you know every few games i'm usually getting one now maybe one one every five to ten games i might get one but i'm getting a lot of quality returns a lot of times you know opponents don't expect me to return balls that i do and get such good yardage from it i, I very often will be able to get into the 30 or the 40 yard line and they get have to make that one lucky play on the last man to stop me so thanks a lot for checking out this video that's my tips on the kick return hope that helps you guys out I've been Time Bomb. You guys are awesome. Put a like on this video. I will catch you guys later. Boom.